Hello everyone, welcome to Root to Mathematics. In this video, we are going to solve this interesting exponential question. So, the given question is how many distinct positive integers valued solution exists to the equation x square minus 7x plus 11 whole to the power x square minus 13x plus 42 equals to 1. So, here we are asked to find the number of possible values of x. So, without any delay, let's start the solution. The given equation is x square minus 7x plus 11 whole to the power x square minus 13x plus 42 equals to 1. So, in the next step, let's take x square minus 7x plus 11 as a and x square minus 13x plus 14 as b. Okay. So, the above equation becomes a to the power b equals to 1. So, in order to satisfy the condition, the first case must be the value of a equals to 1 for b can be any number. Let's just equate a with 1. So, we have x square minus 7x plus 11 equals to 1. This implies this x square minus 7x. Now, by taking this 1 to the left hand side, we have plus 10 equals to 0. This implies this x square minus 5x minus 2x plus 10 equals to 0. Let's take x common. So, x multiplied with x minus 5 and here minus 2 common. So, we have x minus 5 equals to 0. This implies this x minus 2 multiplied with x minus 5 equals to 0. So, from here we can write x equals to 2 or 5 is one of the solution. Next, in the case 2, let's consider a equals to minus 1 for b can be any even number. So, we have taken the value of a as x square minus 7x plus 11 equals to minus 1. This implies this x square minus 7x. Now, by taking this minus 1 to the left hand side, we have plus 12 equals to 0. So, here we have a quadratic equation in order to find the value of x. Let's use middle term splitting method. So, we can write x square minus 4x minus 3x plus 12 equals to 0. This implies this. Let's just take x common. So, we have x minus 4 and from here we will take minus 3 common. So, we have x minus 4 equals to 0. This implies this. We have x minus 3 multiplied with x minus 4 equals to 0. So, from here we have x equals to 3 or x equals to 4 is another solutions. Next, in the case 3, we can consider a the value of the value of a greater than 0 for b equals to 0. So, let's just put the value of b here. So, we have x square minus 13x plus 42 equals to 0. So, here also we have one quadratic equation in order to find the value of x we will apply middle term splitting method. So, we can write x square minus 7x minus 6x plus 42 equals to 0. This implies this. Let's just take x common here. So, x minus 7 minus 6 x minus 7 equals to 0. This implies this x minus 6 multiplied with x minus 7 equals to 0. So, from here we can write x equals to 6 or x equals to 7 is another solution for x. So, from the above cases we can write x equals to either 2 or 5 or 3 or 4 or 6 or so, what I asked to find, we are asked to find number of solution of x. So, here we have 6 possible solution of x is our answer. I hope you have understood the solution. Thanks for watching. Please do subscribe my channel and hit the like button for more such interesting videos. Thank you.